And I remember this quote from Winston Churchill. He said, success is going from failure to failure without losing your enthusiasm. And so it's interesting because that's how your healing journey is going to feel like sometimes. And hopefully my job is to help you go from each failure or trigger. You're going to consider your triggers a failure. That's part of the process. They're not a failure. They're just information. They're not a failure, but you're going to think that it is. And just as you think that you're failing, if I'm doing my job right and I'm in my heart, your enthusiasm for the process will still be aligned. You'll still keep going. And through consistency, you'll look back three months, six months, one year and go, holy fuck. Like I'm still going through challenges. I got this going on in my life. I got that going on with business and this going on in my marriage. And there's usually a resistance. However, look at who I am in the face of this in comparison to that. That's how I want it to be for you. I don't want to give you the kind of illusion, the garden path that doing something like this type of work is going to make things so that everybody always accepts you all the time. They have nothing but positive regard and happiness and good things to say to you. You never have to cope with feelings of rejection anymore. It's just not realistic. And so that's why very few people go to this level of the work because we base it on the truth and reality and what reality is. And we do everything we can to stay in fantasy la la land. And my job is to consistently pull myself back to my reality, the truth of where I am, and then learn a few things about myself that might be useful for you and then share that same thing that I just discovered for other people who are probably challenged with the same thing. Challenged with what? Connection to a sense of purpose, feeling healthy and safe in relationships, feeling engaged in your relationships, like you're connected to one another with intimacy, feeling like you're able to trust yourself to be able to sit in your own emotions and be able to self-soothe and self-regulate, to be able to have healthy give and receive. And I've been working on myself to create that. Namely, a big part of it is doing work that's very inspiring to us. That's really what we all want. And so the reason why you're here is because you're part of that for me.